Alright, what's up guys? Welcome back to a brand new video. Today we're going to be actually covering a drama, okay? I haven't done this in a hot minute on Sign of Roblox, but uh, yeah, I've recently come across this drama through Twitter and YouTube and tons of stuff like that, where this YouTuber is being exposed and tons of stuff like that and basically being just completely thrown in the gutter, bro. But uh, yeah, I'm gonna be giving my unbiased opinion and all of that good stuff inside of this video, so uh, yeah, smash like and subscribe let's get into this okay so the youtuber we have in question today his name is jeremy or something like that jerome i i have no clue i've literally never heard of this guy until recently with seeing him getting exposed and all that stuff on my timeline and basically he's being exposed for like bullying underage children and uh harassing adopt me developers and doing uh, a bunch of uh sketchy things inside of adopt me and all kinds of stuff like that okay it's a uh, really interesting interesting situation and yeah so let's kind of dive a little bit deeper into this boys but before i say a thing about any of this drama don't go saying hate to anyone inside of the video just sending hate to people is a horrible thing to do okay it's not necessary whatsoever okay mans will get his doings his done done did it for whatever he's done wrong man but uh yeah don't go saying hate to anyone that's just not cool but uh yeah okay Okay, so basically, the majority of this new drama to really come out to what literally launched this completely into the Roblox spotlight at this point was actually a tweet by Adopt Me, okay, basically saying, okay, look, he's harassing one of our developers and he's been banned for breaking Roblox rules and breaking Adopt Me rules by purchasing some uh, Adopt Me items with money and Robux and tons of stuff like that. Basically, breaking rules you're not supposed to do inside of Adopt Me, okay? And he's rightly banned from the game, okay? I completely understand it. I mean, if you're harassing a developer of the game and breaking the rules, I mean, you know, you kind of deserve to be banned. But, you know, it's just how it be, though. There's even also rumors that he begs his fans to go and harass people, too. Like, pays them with, like, uh, adopt me pets or something like that to go and uh, defend him for all of his wrongdoings, bro. I don't really know how true it is to that. I, I haven't done that much research to figure out if that's true or not but it's just the thing i've heard around the bushes bro just pointing it out okay but uh yeah you can go through the comments of this tweet literally and there's just a bunch of uh, replies defending them him but you know they get uh pretty ratioed out to be honest but uh yeah this is a really uh, trashy situation that we're gonna be taking a look at i guess you know i keep uh laughing at this reply over here okay uh a youtuber named real roses are red basically made a reply saying oh i don't think he believes he got his stuff fair and square and he just like replied it was it's a deleted reply now but he said just shut up star creator that is single-handedly probably going to be like one of the, the new cringe uh you know that's just a beautiful statement okay it's hilarious just uh yeah instead of cringe guys we're gonna just start tweeting shut up star creator okay this is a beautiful situation boys i don't care what anyone says i'm dying okay it's hilarious and, like, what do you guys think about this, uh, drama here? Do you think he deserved to be banned from the game? I mean, personally, I do believe he deserved to be banned from the game. But also, I mean, I know there are tons of other YouTubers doing the exact same thing. Buying items and just, like, using real money for it. But they're not banned. But at the same time, I mean, like, dude's been harassing and just all that. And they finally found, like, a real reason to actually ban him from the game that broke their rules, you know? So, I mean, it's like, okay, I, it's understandable for being a little bit more biased there but like at the same time i mean they're doing the same thing but it's not justifying his actions so yes he rightly deserves to be banned from the game there's also th tons of threads on Twitter you can go through and find real quick that uh, bring a talk about a lot of the other dramas where he's harassed developers, bullied children, and tons of things like that. And there's even, you know, a drama that I don't necessarily agree with where he overpriced a uh, Royal High item. I will never agree with that drama, but, you know, it's still there and it exists. But, uh, yeah, all the other dramas, I completely understand 100%. Uh, deserves to be get repercussions okay but uh, yeah that's it for this video personally i believe he's getting right fully what he deserves by being banned from the game and getting this backlash for what he's done but uh yeah smash like subscribe don't get shot please please do not get murdered and i will see you guys inside of the next roblox video